Hey, what's up? I wanted to do a review here on the Sentry Calming Collar. I don't know if you can read that. It looks backwards on my screen. But I got this collar because um, I have five dogs right now. And uh, one of them has Addison's disease. And when her Addison's disease flares up, she gets extremely nervous. You could see her here. She's in the house. She's not her usual self. She's very worried and kind of like depressed. So I got this collar here to put on her to see um, what kind of effects it had on her. I also have a 10 pound miniature pincher mix who has a kind of crazy mind state most of the time. Hey Nemo. Um, you could see in one of my other videos, he actually climbed a six foot chain link fence just to escape to get into the yard with my third dog with anxiety, Kai. Kai has a severe aggression issues that we've been working on for about a year now. Kai, come on Kai. Come on Coke. Come on pup. That's a good pup. There's Kai. So I'm going to try this collar on Taya first. I'm going to try this collar on Nemo second. And if possible, I'm going to put the collar on Kai. And I'm going to let you guys know how it works. So it's kind of um, a little tricky to put on. With Kai, is going to be difficult because she doesn't like um, hands around her neck too much. She'll eventually start snapping. So... Um, I'm going to work with this collar and I'm going to show you guys a video of each one of my dogs after having the collar on for probably an hour. Um, doesn't really say how long it takes to work, but we'll figure it out. Uh, she's been wearing this collar for a day now. And... Um, Doing okay, but I don't think it's really doing anything. So after a whole day of wearing the collar, come on Tay. Um, come on Ma. I don't think it really made her super a lot less worried. Um, Maybe it affected her a little bit, but probably not enough that I would buy it again. Um, so yeah, that's so far with this dog, I don't think it makes that much of a difference. What's up, Neem? This is Nemo. Nemo's been climbing fences. He's very high strung. So we're gonna put the calming collar on Nemo. We're going to see if it helps him out at all. Come here, Nemo. What's up, Neem? Neem, Kalameem. I'm just going to leave this wrapped around here twice because we're still going to put it on the third dog, Kai. But we're going to see if this helps Nemo out. We're going to leave it on him for a day and see. For those of you who don't know, which is probably everyone, because it, but probably no one's even going to see this video, um, Nemo has got a lot of serious issues. He pees all over the house. He climbs over the fence six foot high just to escape to get into kennels with dogs that have previously injured him or quite possibly will seriously injure him. He also escapes the yard he wants to go hang out on really busy streets. Nemo's got a barking issue. He jumps up. He doesn't really seem to be as aware of the other dogs as he should be. He wanders off when we're on trails. So we're putting this collar on him. I'm going to see if this helps him out. I'd be surprised if it even stops him 
from escaping from his kennel and from trying to climb out, I'd be very surprised. But this collar is double wrapped, so this is like double strength. May not even, may be actually too strong for him. But he's a tough guy. He likes, jumps off the six foot fence just to get into the yard, the main yard. This is how Nemo is when he when he wants to get out of his crate. This is after wearing this collar for 12 hours. So far, not so impressed. Oh my god. I think he's even more hyper than he was before. He did sit down, that's good. So here we try to go to breakfast with all four dogs. Taya, Henry, Tim. Last, definitely also least, Nematode. Nematode, this collar honestly makes no difference. Zero difference. The only difference is, is that you're surprised because you think he's supposed to be acting more calm. I mean, he's sitting here right now. That's not from the collar, that's from me correcting him repeatedly that he needs to sit here if he wants to come to lunch so i don't know general opinion at this point with nemo just after just 12 hours you see he's got an e-collar on too but this collar doesn't do anything i don't really think it does um if you want your dog to not actually be more calm you just want to put things on it i would suggest get this collar but this is dog number two we tried it on. We're gonna try it on um, the crazy dog. Like right now, perfect example of Nemo just being crazy. He's trying to climb up on me for no reason. Nemo, stop. Nothing's gonna calm a dog down like being trained, being told very clearly what's good and what's bad. That's what's gonna train the dog down. Exercise, I mean, and to mention it, Nemo hiked like two miles yesterday. But he has to be leashed here. He just wanders off. He's just... He's a nervous wreck. This collar does nothing. So for anybody who was wondering, we were going to put the collar on Kai, but... Uh, the collar is pretty hard to get on and off. It's pretty technical, and Kai at the time was really wanting to bite. Um, so I decided not to put it on her, especially because it didn't work on two dogs. I figured there's really no point in putting it on a third dog. So... End of story. I don't think this thing works. Train your dog if you want your dog to be calm. That's my opinion.